video will show you how to create a three-dimensional shape using the Revolve feature. The Revolve feature allows you to create symmetrically round shapes using a two-dimensional drawing. For example, suppose we want to create a pulley. First, draw a circle in the top view. Set the diameter to 4 inches. Set the Z value to 1 inch. Let's look at the 3D view. Revolve shapes start with a cylinder like this. Next we need to draw the shape to be revolved. This is done by changing to the front view. Select View, Front to see the rectangular front view of the cylinder. The vertical dashed line in the center represents the revolve axis. On the right side of the rectangle, draw a rectangle to represent a cross section of the pulley. Set the vertical dimension to 1 inch. Set the horizontal dimension to 1.5 inches. Set Z to revolve. A quarter inch space is left between the revolve axis and the rectangle to create a half inch diameter hole in the center of the pulley. Let's look at the 3D view. Now we have a hole created by taking the rectangle we drew and revolving it around the center axis. Now let's create the pulley groove. Draw a circle. Set the diameter to 0 0.8. Drag the circle to the right side of the rectangle, snapping the circle center to the center of the side of the rectangle. Select the circle and rectangle. Click the Intersect button. Delete the extra lines. Select the remaining lines. Click the Group button to group the lines together. Click the Pyramid button and notice that the revolved shape creates a pulley. Additional features can be applied to the part using views that do not include the revolve axis. For example, suppose we wanted to add a through hole to our pulley. Select View, Top, to change to the top view. Draw a small circle. Set the diameter to 0 0.2. Set the Z value to inner inside to make a hole. Click the pyramid button and notice the through hole on the pulley.